you throw them away. So why are your family's movies, slides and photos sitting in your basement, unseen and unloved? You can convert them with forever into digital formats that you'll be able to enjoy and share with your family. In this video, I'm going to have Monica walk you through the process of packaging up your precious memories into a forever conversion box. A forever conversion box will allow you to get secure shipping from your home to the forever conversion site in Green Bay. They'll be handled with white glove service and then they'll be shipped back to you. Your videos, photos, slides will all be added to your forever account and you'll be able to share and enjoy them. Of course, you'll still have the originals, they are shipped back to you. As Monica explains, each box comes with a certain amount of conversion credits, but you can fill that box to the brim and just pay any extras that might be needed to convert everything. So let's take a look at how easy it is to get your old photos and videos ready for conversion. My forever box came today and I'm excited to break into it and show you what it looks like when you're getting ready to do a media conversion. So the box arrives just like this in your mailbox or on your front porch and it's just taped closed right here. Get into that. And then the box just slides open like this. And inside you have a Ziploc bag that has the information you need about how to create your conversion and an empty box. Before we look at how to set up the conversion for your supplies, let's look at how big the box is. So I have a ruler here. The interior of the box is about eight and a half inches wide by about eight and a half inches deep. So it is, it is an eight and a half by eight and a half box. Just for your frame of reference, here is an old um, VHS tape. So that would fit inside. I'm not sure, I don't know that you could get two of them in there. You could maybe squeeze two side by side. You could definitely get two stacked on top because it is two and a half inches tall. So you could get two stacked upright there. A uh, little bit more perspective. I went and grabbed a six by eight album. So a six by eight album, this one would not fit. The six by eights themselves, the inside pages, let's just take one out so you can see. The inside page, six by eight page would fit. It's a little bit, um, like it would be a tight fit. But a six by eight page would fit in there. Depending on the size of your album, the entire album might not fit, but you could certainly get your pages in there. This is a snap album and it would be too wide to fit in there, but it's really close, but not quite. You could get a lot, this is four by six, you could get a lot of four by six photos in here um, if you were wanting to do a photo conversion and a lot of slides would also fit. What I am converting today are four mini DV tapes uh, of my children. And obviously these are all gonna fit easily in the small size box. A basic box comes with a certain amount of conversion items included, and then you can fill the box with as many as you want and just pay an additional fee for each item. You don't have to order a larger box unless you have a larger size item that you're wanting to convert. So I'm going to do these four mini DV tapes. So let's take a look at what's inside here. It comes with this packet that has my shipping labels and then um, I can add each a label onto each item so it knows exactly how many and a number, let's see here, and then the shipping label that goes on the outside of the packet, package. So it gives you the services. So it tells you how many, how much it is for each additional item if you have more than what comes with the box. A place to put your customer information and a place for any notes that you might want to add on um, 
when you are ordering your services. So this will go back in the box when it's finished. Here is the direction packet. Has that same information chart. So $79 is for the basic box. It includes $50 of services. So you look over here and you can add up to $50. I am doing the videotape or cassette conversion with my mini DV tapes. So they are essentially $25 each. So two of them will be included with the cost of the box. And then I will pay an additional uh, amount for the other two. The other boxes are larger in size if you have larger sized media that you would like to convert. But like I said, you don't have to get a larger size box um, just to do more than what comes with the basic. So just because there's only two tapes included doesn't mean I can't fill this with many more tapes. So it gives you your packing instructions. You fill out the customer order form. That was this one. Fill that out. You prepare your items for shipping by grouping them into media types. So they send you some bags. So if I was doing more than one thing, I would put all my tapes in one bag, all my photos in another bag. So there are three Ziploc bags included in the box. And they suggest grouping items in no less than 25 and no more than 300 pictures, slides, or negatives. If you are um, putting in cassette tapes like I am doing, they want you to label them each individually and number in the order you would like them transferred. So if like these have uh, on them years, so if I want them converted in a certain order, then I would number them in that way. They, you can also have photo albums or scrapbooks converted and each individual album or scrapbook needs its own label. Then you put your your media back inside this box and attach the shipping label onto the front and it's ready to drop off at a FedEx location to ship. So this just gives you information about the types of media they can convert and um, the size of film they can convert if you have film rolls. So this is for you to keep, it just has the information for you. The labels and numbers will go on each of these. So let me see, let's look at the order that I want to convert. This, this one is first 2005 to 2006. So that one will have number one. This one is 2006, so that will have a number two. This is 2007 and this one is 2008. So that's the order I want them converted. And I can go in here and add all my information, notes I have, and how many of my video cassettes I'm including in the box. Now that I have my tapes labeled in the order I want them converted, I can add them to my bag. On the bag, I've put my label that has the order number and my contact address. So these go inside this bag, which gets sealed up, and placed inside the conversion box, and I add my inf customer information in there. Close it up. And now all I need to do is add my label, tape it closed, and it'll be ready to ship off and begin my conversion. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this quick overview of how to get your family photos and videos ready for conversion. In the next video, Monica will walk you through what happens when you get your box back. If you'd like to learn more about Forever and how you can convert, preserve and enjoy your memories, head to digiscraphq.com slash forever. If you're a new customer, sign up to get $10 off your first conversion box.